Whoa. Here we go. Your shoes are going to get wet. Ah. Six-year-old Jack Tunnel enjoys time on the Corpus Christi shoreline with his dad. Dad, my shoes got wet. Uh, we only live two blocks from Cole Park, so. Oh, that one worked. We come down here pretty often since we live so close. Very convenient place. It's just a beautiful place to be. But after a rain, what they see here is not always so pretty. Whoa, now that's nasty. Urban trash can cause trouble for both freshwater and saltwater ecosystems. It is a problem Jace Tunnel is familiar with through his work for local coastal conservation groups. Coastal Bend Bays and Estuaries Programs, Jace. We deal a lot with trying to solve the water quality issues that we have. Uh, bay debris is part of that. You know, any trash that goes into the bay, like plastics, it takes many, many years for that to be able to biodegrade. And it's not pretty to see, but it's also bad for the animals. But when it rains, I think lots of times people don't realize that whatever's on the ground will end up in the bay in the end. To raise awareness, Jace grabbed his video camera during a rainfall and captured much more than stormwater flowing out to sea. It blew my mind to see how much trash was coming out. And unfortunately, that's just the stuff that floats. I was showing it to Jack, and his eyes just opened up, and he said, you know, whoa. Whatever trash is on the road, and it rains, it's going to get washed into the bay. Oh, yeah. So father and son made a short video. All the cups. And a plea to keep we'll all the cups right from harming the environment. I like this part. You like this part? Yeah. Okay. We want people to stop throwing trash everywhere, and um, that's all. All right. Coincidentally, as their video hit YouTube, the city was launching its own anti-litter campaign. It takes a lot of different approaches to address the issue. We've had a lot of news media, uh, advertisements, an app that was developed, TV commercials. Only you can stop the wrath of trash. Don't litter. And the overall goal of it is to bring litter awareness to everyone in the city. We do have a beautiful city and we want to keep it that way. We want to remain the sparkling city by the sea. The challenges being faced in Corpus are by no means unique. There is concern worldwide about the impacts of trash on marine life. But this complex problem is nicely summed up by young Jack. Don't throw the trash in the water. Um, fish and birds eat it, and they get so hungry that they die. All the Cups has yet to go as viral as, say, stray cups and bottles, but the video has been seen by thousands. And as more see how quickly litter can pollute a waterway, perhaps more will choose to recycle, or at least dispose of their trash responsibly. Anything on the ground, just make sure you pick it up. Whether it's trash, oil, whatever's on the ground, it's gonna end up in the bay, it's gonna end up in the waterways. So the main take home is, uh, you know, awareness. A little awareness and personal responsibility can keep our waters clean and fish and wildlife healthy. Oh. And that makes for happier days at the beach. Perfect. And you really know how to pick them out.